going to heaven. The video commences with advertisements promoting the integration of artificial intelligence into American society, aimed at simplifying human life. In 2055, a nuclear weapon detonates in Los Angeles due to AI developed by the US government, resulting in the incineration of over a million people. Consequently, the military initiates a campaign to eradicate all AI across the country. However, they encounter resistance from New Asia, where the remaining AI are regarded as fellow citizens. The colossal space station USS Nomad, North American Orbital Mobile Aerospace Defense, is created and deployed to survey the Earth for any AI remnants, intending to eliminate them and unveil the so-called Nirmata, the founder of the AI. Sergeant Joshua Taylor is a decade into his journey and resides in Koh Nong, New Asia, with his pregnant wife, Maya. Maya holds a stronger connection to AI compared to Joshua, who utilizes a prosthetic arm and leg. During the night, a squad of droid cops led by Haroon arrives at their home, accompanied by a soldier. Joshua privately interrogates the man, who turns out to be his comrade and commanding officer, Drew. Joshua has been secretly married because his superior suspect Maya is Nermita's daughter. When soldiers outside initiate an assault, Maya learns the truth about Joshua and escapes from him. Attempting to flee on a boat, Maya's group is struck by an explosion launched by Nomad, resulting in her tragic death while Joshua watches helplessly. Five years later, Joshua is employed as part of a cleanup crew at Ground Zero in Los Angeles. While on one of his patrols, he and his partner come across a droid exhibiting signs of sentience. They proceed to disable it, a decision likened by the partner to relieving a human of their suffering. Left alone, Joshua REFLX on his past experiences with Maya, reminiscing about their time together. General Andrews and Colonel Howell approach Joshua, presenting intelligence suggesting that Nirmata is operating in New Asia to develop a superweapon capable of destroying Nomad. They urge Joshua to join their efforts in thwarting this threat. Initially hesitant, Joshua is swayed when Howell reveals a holographic recording suggesting that Maya is alive and working at the facility where the weapon is being constructed. Furthermore, they inform Joshua that he possesses critical knowledge of the lab's layout, making him indispensable in the mission to both win the war and reunite with his wife. Joshua joins Howell's group as they journey towards New Asia. She confides in Joshua about her deep-seated animosity towards AI, a result of losing her sons in the conflict. Prior to attacking the lab, the troops incite the villagers by firing at the technicians. Joshua decides to part ways with the squad and enters a room where he stumbles upon the weapon, a small robot girl, engrossed in watching cartoons. A woman, protecting the child, shoots at Joshua and orders the girl to escape before he can apprehend her. A fierce shootout erupts between the New Asia military and Nomad mercenaries. Eventually, Joshua catches up to the girl and persuades her to board a boat for escape. Joshua finds himself in a desolate area near the lake with the child, accompanied by a wounded soldier named Shipley who tragically succumbs to his injuries. While exploring, he stumbles upon the girl inside a house engrossed in watching TV and utilizing her abilities to remotely manipulate equipment. Observing an Alpha Omega sign carved into her head, Joshua affectionately dubs the child, Alfie. He reaches out to Howell, who directs him to bring the child to her. They are discovered by an adult droid who is astonished to encounter Alfie. Although the robot assures Joshua that no harm will come to them, he reaches for a pistol lying on the floor, prompting Joshua to defend himself by shooting the droid. This action attracts nearby droid forces to their location, initiating a barrage of gunfire on the house. In a bid to escape, Joshua and Alfie hastily get into a vehicle and speed away from the scene. Howell and her subordinate, McBride, embark on a journey in a vehicle. 
During their journey, they encounter a droid officer whom they eliminate, utilizing the officer's body to conceal Shipley's remains after Joshua disposes of him and transfers his consciousness to the droid. They have only a limited window of time to discover that Joshua is the father of the child. Subsequently, compelled to abandon the van, Joshua and Alfie hitch a ride with a family. As they navigate past a checkpoint during the night, Alfie employs her magic to disrupt the officials' equipment. When the officials start shooting at them, Joshua takes control of the van, ultimately enabling their escape, much to the dissatisfaction of the family accompanying them. After successfully evading notice, Joshua and Alfie boarded a train bound for the city. During their journey, Alfie asked Joshua about heaven, to which he responded that he would not go there since only nice people are allowed. They were traveling to visit Drew, who had moved in with his own robot partner, Cammy. Drew's perspective on the AI community had significantly changed, and he now collaborated with Joshua and Cammy to investigate Alfie. It was revealed that Alfie had not yet reached the full extent of her abilities and had the potential to become the most powerful being alive, capable of remotely controlling any piece of technology from anywhere on Earth. After ordering ice cream for Alfie, Cammy hears a knock at the door, only to find out it's a bomb that tragically kills her. Authorities in New Asia respond by opening fire on the group. Joshua successfully disarms the robot policemen, preventing them from harming Alfie. However, more officers arrive, joined by Howell and McBride, intensifying the attack. Drew sustains severe injuries, but before passing away, he assists Joshua in locating Maya's beacon and reveals that Maya herself is near Mata. In a desperate attempt to escape, Joshua and Alfie flee, but they are apprehended by a unit of soldiers under Haroon's command. Joshua regains consciousness aboard a ship, finding himself confined as a prisoner. Haroon approaches him and discloses that the Los Angeles warhead incident resulted from a human-made coding error falsely attributed to the AI. Additionally, he explains how Maya assumed the role of Nirmata after her father, the original Nirmata, passed away. While Haroon insists that AI would never pose a threat to humans, he refuses to take Joshua to Nirmata. Meanwhile, outside the ship, the AI begin to show signs of apprehension upon realizing they are being observed. Seizing an opportunity, Joshua breaks free from his cell but becomes a target, prompting him to leap into the ocean. Despite being fired upon, he clings to the ship's hull, managing to evade being completely submerged. After the ship docks at a settlement, Joshua heads there to locate and rescue Alfie. Suddenly, Howell and her men arrive, launching an assault on the village. They bring massive machinery and a suicide bomb robot that rushes into the town to detonate. Another suicide robot races across the bridge, but Alfie intervenes, using her strength to disable it. However, McBride then shoots Alfie, breaking the connection just as the robot blows up the bridge. As McBride aims at Alfie once more, Joshua kills him first. Haroon instructs Joshua to take Alfie to a temple where Maya is being cared for. Maya has been in a coma for the past five years, and due to the robot's inability to harm Nirmata, they cannot disconnect her from life support. Joshua also uncovers that Alfie is designed based on their unborn child, who was scanned during pregnancy, essentially making Alfie their daughter. Joshua gazes at his wife once more before unplugging the life support. When Howell and her thugs reach the temple, they try to force Joshua and Alfie inside. In a desperate move, Haroon throws a bomb at Howell, but Alfie manages to defuse it, stunning Howell. However, her two minions attempt to shoot Alfie, resulting in the bomb detonating and taking the lives of all three before Howell can intervene. As more soldiers gather, Haroon tells Joshua that to halt the conflict, Nomad needs to be eliminated. In the midst of leaving, Joshua and Alfie are captured by droid officers. Andrews instructs Joshua to eliminate Alfie upon their return to Los Angeles. As Joshua prepares to pull the trigger, a fleeting moment of sadness passes between them. However, 
While en route to the incinerator, news spreads of anti-nomad protesters gathering in the streets. Suddenly, the vehicles start losing power and stall on the street. It's revealed that Alfie is still alive, and both she and Joshua orchestrated a plan to feign her death, allowing them to escape. The two climb aboard a lunar shuttle destined for Nomad. Andrews discovers the scheme too late and starts devising plans to utilize Nomad for an attack on the other AI bases. Joshua and Alfie successfully bypass armed guards, ejecting them into space. While Joshua attempts to install an explosive on one of their rockets, Alfie uses her ability to temporarily disable Nomad's power. As they head towards an escape pod, Alfie stumbles upon a chamber filled with humanoid robot corpses and finds one belonging to Maya. She transfers her consciousness into it, hoping to revive her and take her along with Joshua, but her efforts seem to be unsuccessful. As Joshua and Alfie attempt their escape, Andrews deploys a massive tentacle robot. Despite the challenge, Joshua manages to disable the robot, ensuring Alfie's safety. However, in the process, he becomes stranded aboard Nomad. Before parting ways, Joshua and Alfie share a poignant moment, confessing their love for each other. With a heavy heart, Joshua exits the vessel, leaving Alfie behind. As he steps out, he encounters the Maya robot, and in a heartfelt reunion, they embrace and share a final kiss just before the bomb triggers the annihilation of Nomad, effectively halting any further strikes. Meanwhile, Andrews and his henchmen watch in dismay. Alfie's pod safely returns to Earth. Upon witnessing the celebration of Nomad's demise, a subtle smile graces Alfie's face.